Hello to you from Milan, a city synonymous with high fashion. The stadium might not be fashionable anymore, but it remains iconic for San Siro. I'm Derek Ray, joined for commentary by former England international Lee Dixon, and we've got so much to look forward to. This is where it all begins in Europe's Premier Club competition, the UEFA Champions League, the group stage, match day one action. It's Inter facing Real Madrid. Yeah, it's very important that you're not playing catch-up in the group stages. Match day one, imperative, you get off to a good start. The UEFA Champions League has come a long way since it came into existence back in 1992-93 and there are many, Lee, who say it's the highest standard of football you'll see anywhere. Well, I think it is the best club competition uh, in the world. I think the competition at the top, at the end, near the final, etc. is what it is. But the tournament is strong throughout the group stages and then the knockout stages. It's the perfect format for me. Inter's lineup is as follows. Samir Handanovic begins between the posts. Milan Skriniar plays alongside Stefan de Frey in central defence. Marcelo Brozovic plays with Arturo Vidal in central midfield. And the story in attack is one of a strike partnership. And the starting players for Real Madrid. Thibaut Courtois is in goal. Carvajal plays with Ferland Mendy in the fullback positions. Luka Modric plays with Casemiro in the centre of the pitch. And beginning the game up front today, Karim Benzema. It's the opening match day. Champions League group stage, match day one, underway. And taken away. Hakimi. Hakimi. Well, a poor attempt at a challenge, and on he goes. It might be on for them. Can he put them in front? A truly magnificent start. An early goal in the game. Just what they were hoping to produce. Well, you tell youngsters in that position just to hit the target. You can't score unless you do. And on this occasion, he does, and he scores. Slightly different vantage point in terms of the goal that was scored. Well, I think the coach can feel the game slipping away here. He's showing his frustration on the sidelines. Action underway once more. A wake-up call for the Real players, maybe. Can they find a response now? Benzema. Attacking possibilities for Real. In with a chance. Not out of the woods yet. Threat over for now, it seems. Well, these Inter fans want another goal to feel a little safer. They know this game's on a knife edge. Just listen to the noise. Well, they get the ball once more. Far from a good pass. Well, that's gone out, and it is going to be a goal kick. Hazard. Modric. Well, they're on the scent of something positive. Could be! Well, that's really sound goalkeeping, not letting the opposition have any scraps. Corner given to Real Madrid. Can he get them level? 
And a goal! The keeper couldn't stop it. Real Madrid on terms. Well, here's the replay, Derek. It's a good, strong ball into the box. And then it just gets better and better from there. Superb. Softly passing the volley into the net. Lovely goal. Well, it's not easy being a manager, and that's why they've let him down a bit there. So, a level contest. 1-1. One, one. Real Madrid with the number 14, Casemiro. Brozovic. Martinez using his physical strength to shield it. Barella moving the ball forward with purpose. Oh, big chance! And a goal! Just like that, they're back in front! Well, here's the replay. It's a very neat piece of deception to get past the defender. And then through on goal, you never really had any doubt he was going to slot that way. Good finish. Well, just look at the reactions on the touchline. They just need to keep their composure now. This is far from over. So the game has been restarted. What sort of response will that elicit from Real Madrid? Benzema. Now Casemiro. Carvajal. Modric. Mendy has it. Really inventive stuff from Real here. Aiden Azar. And a foul in the opinion of the referee. Now, what can they do from this free kick situation? He'll take this on. And the free kick, not far off at all. Technique, just look at this technique, and he's inches over. Well, I'm pretty sure the manager's wondering how many more chances there'll be to get back into this game. Physically strong and secure on the ball. Lukaku. Martinez, Lukaku, now Brozovic, and return to Brozovic, Vidal, can they keep it out? Oh, and he puts away the second chance, but the goalkeeper angry with himself here. Well, here's the replay, and Derek, a lot of the time, the keeper saved the day. The last line of defence, but he's had a nightmare here. Big mistake, and the goal goes down to him. Well, that's a tale of four goals in this match now. 3-1 it is. Isco. Now with Benzema. Isco has it. Tony Kroos. Modric. So plenty of forward momentum from Real Madrid here. And he takes on the shot. Well, that would be straightforward for any keeper. Kroos. Benzema. Well, that's how to break the spirit of the attacker. Well, let's see what they have in store for them on the break.
Well, as we see, Inter in control of possession here. And what that does, it just relaxes the team. If you've got the ball, you enjoy the ball. And they're turning it into goals as well. Possession lost. And room now out on the flank. Easy save. Hakimi. Brozovic. Vidal. Not advantage with them. Referee says play on. Beautifully timed. Well, that's gone out, and it is going to be a goal kick. Rafael Varan. Azar. And now here's Aiden Azar. The ball with Luka Modric. He takes aim. And a goal to delight the fans. Just what they were hoping for. Well, the keeper thinks the crossbar saved him. But have a look again, young man. It's in the back of the net. Slightly different vantage point in terms of the goal that was scored. Well, the manager will be frustrated, no doubt about it. Still in the lead, though. Not all doom and gloom. On they go again, and I wonder, can Real push for a leveller here? Martinez. Made it a bit too easy for his opponent. Martinez. High quality defending. So a throw in here. Plenty of players waiting in the middle. So a corner for Inter. What can they do with this one? It's a short corner. And the referee sees that as a foul. Free kick given. Well, no card, but the referee making it clear next time there will be one shown. Nicely cut out. A corner will ensue. Over it comes. The clearance wasn't decisive. Behind for another corner. Can they cash in? Well, he's been kicking and heading every ball in that technical area. They've been good up to now, but it's still fine margins. It wasn't an especially high-quality header, was it? Well, that was like one of mine, or more to the point, like one of yours, Derek. You're spot on with that assessment, Lee. Modric. And a poor ball. Well, threat about it. Well, they are on the wrong end of the scoreline. But, Lee, your overall thoughts on their current situation? Well, this Madrid side just needs to up the tempo a little bit in the second half. They've had some joy, especially in midfield and up front. The this could level it. 
An important challenge, but they must remain organised. Racing forward, trying to catch them out. End product or not. Lukaku. Well, he's got past his man. What can he do from here? Well, they haven't overcome all the difficulties. And over comes the corner. And he clears the danger. Hakimi. Ball played nicely. Lukaku. Matsuro Vidal. And intercepted it. The pressure was on Varane. The first half here comes to an end. I think most fans would be pretty happy with this man's display so far. Well, if he plays like that in the second half, we're in for a real treat. He's scored, he's direct, creative, and he unnerves defenders. And so the second half of this Champions League group stage match day one contest commences. Tony Kroos. On to Benzema. Beautifully disguised ball. Well, that's really sound goalkeeping, not letting the opposition have any scraps. The referee correctly decided to play advantage. Lukaku. This is Vidal. Isco. Here's Casemiro. Mendy. Karim Benzema in the thick of things. And just too much height on the header. Alessandro Bastoni. This is Vidal. Good looking ball. There could be a chance now. Is it going to be? Might still be able to do a bit of damage. And in at the second time of asking, but the goalkeeper badly at fault. Well, as we see this again, Derek, it's easy to be critical. And I'll stress, I've never been a goalkeeper, but surely he's got to do better than that. His mistake leads to the goal, no doubt about it. So the current scoreline, 4-2. Casemiro. The ball with Luka Modric. Azar. Tony Kroos. And very deftly cut out. Barella. This is Vidal. Martinez. And good use of advantage. The referee allowing play to continue. Throw-ins given. Modric. Azar. Azar! The crossbar got in the way. Course. And able to get a body in the way. Ashley Young. And they will be awarded a free kick for that.
He's been admonished by the referee. He's now got to walk something of a tightrope. Yeah, he knows exactly where he stands. Look at the referee, how he's told him off there. No yellow card, but certainly knows what the referee's thinking. Nicolò Barella entra con il numero 44. Martinez. Vidal. Oh, good defending to stop a decent looking attack. And 30 minutes left for play in this match. Oh, what an opportunity. Surely. In it goes. A goal to get the blood flowing. Just what he wanted. Well, here it is again. It's all about the pace in transition. They were so quick to get out from the back. And he composes himself, coolly slides it past a lonely keeper who will be asking questions about where his back four went to. Well, what an extraordinary scoreline. Does this game have more goals in it? Con il numero 7, Eden Hazard. Vidal. Isco. Here's Casemiro. Surely the equaliser. Superb block on the back of the ball from the flank. They favoured a short one here. Teammate in support. Well, he did his job defensively. Casemiro. Possession seeded by the Merengues. And breaking at pace with Menace. Laid into the centre. Well, it fizzled out. Carvajal. Isco has it. Course. Here's Modric. Benzema. And Benzema! Surely! Chance, maybe! Well, able to survive that attacking push. Raja Nainggolan. So, 20 minutes to go. And it's gone out for a throw-in to Real Madrid. Time for a change, then. For more on the injury, let's go down to our reporter, Jeff Shreves. He landed really awkwardly on his shoulder there, and he's in some discomfort. But he's a tough cookie. I think he'll stay out there. Cheers, Jeff. This could level it. And it is the equaliser. Parity now. And who's to say what's going to happen next? Well, as we see from the replay, it's a classic pullback cross that sets up the chance. And then it's probably the easiest tapping he will ever get. Lovely stuff. And it's level again here. Both sets of fans being put through something of an emotional mangle. Benzema. Well, Derek, the tactics for both sides are simple. Attack. They're both trying to win the game, creating chances. It's a brilliant game. Martinez. Inter in a position of menace. Precise ball movement. Now they've lost the ball. Benzema. Take it away. Brozovic. Well, into Milan are pushing. They really are. They can feel the energy from this crowd. And after that fantastic effort, it's gone out for a throw in. So, a personnel change then. 
Hakimi. Martinez. Now Lukaku. Gives it a go. Watered by the post. And the decision offside here. Carvajal. Karim Benzema. Intelligent threaded pass here. Ball is loose. But it looks so threatening, but the danger averted. Lukaku. Now nine Golan. And breaking at pace with Menace. It has gone over the touchline for what will be a throw in. Very good refereeing to let the play flow. Isco on the offensive. Is there to be late excitement? And pull back. Crucial intervention just then amid impending danger. With time running out, a corner to Real Madrid. And deciding to go short with this one. And he takes it on. He'll be cross with himself based on the position he had taken up. Well, yeah, it was poor technique, wasn't it? Thrashed at it a little bit, went for power. Nainggolan. Skriniar. Christian Eriksen now. Vidal. How can they nudge in front late on here? A real opening now. And begging to be put away. This is why we adore this game. Late drama. And now they're in front. Well, it looks like the game is over, but no. There's another chance. And there it is, back of the net. Looks like the winner. Well, here's the replay. He didn't panic, did he? Decent strike, good technique. Bread and butter strike, really. But it's in the back of the net. So the game has been restarted. What sort of response will that elicit from Real Madrid? Aidan Azar. Real Madrid attacking, and they have to give it a go with time not on their side. Now oh, doesn't get away with it. Free kick given. That could well be his final warning. He's got to tread carefully from here on in. Well, he has, yeah, but it's quite easy for the referees to throw yellow cards around willy-nilly, but not on this occasion. Modric. Wonderfully weighted pass. This could be the equaliser. Well, body in the way. And now they have the ball back. Lukaku, this is Vidal, foul there, free kick awarded, it comes to nothing in the end, Well, now it is final, and Real Madrid will be wondering where it went awry tonight. A terrible start to their Champions League campaign. That's the last thing you need. Start of the qualifying stages. You don't need a zero point, Sally. You almost need memory loss now to forget about that. Down to five games to qualify. Well, he's done what he set out to do. Romelu Lukaku tonight. Well, he never gave that back line a chance to get a breath. Two goals for the lad today. Played superbly well, looked really sharp. Constantly playing on the shoulder of the last defender. A real handful. Can he get them level? And a goal! 
the keeper couldn't stop it. Real Madrid on terms. Moving the ball forward with purpose. Oh, big chance. And a goal! Just like that, they're back in front. Vidal. Can they keep it out? away the second chance but the goalkeeper angry with himself here the ball with Luka Modric he takes aim and a goal to delight the fans just what they were hoping for good looking ball there could be a chance now is it going to be Might still be able to do a bit of damage. And in at the second time of asking, but the goalkeeper badly at fault. This could level it. And it is the equaliser. Parity now. And who's to say what's going to happen next? And begging to be put away. This is why we adore this game. Late drama. And now... They're in front.